It can be filthy gorgeous. It can be gorgeous chic. It can be gorgeous tacky in anything. Uh, can be, I think you can use the term gorgeous with anything. For instance, this dress I'm wearing right now is gorgeous. These earrings are gorgeous. This necklace is gorgeous. Um, the wig, I guess you can call it gorgeous. You know, there's, there's, there's a lot in Hollywood that it actually becomes gorgeous. But show me someone who created themselves. That's more interesting. That's more gorgeous. It's more of a, uh, a state of mind, you know? You're, you, you feel that beauty that turns into gorgeousness. Well, I like a really gritty voice. Sounds like somebody's two steps away from getting a trach. Uh, so somebody's smoking for decades and then they start to sing, that's my jam. I'm, I'm a science major, went to UC Berkeley and we had an anatomy class and we would like pick at these brains. You know, and these brands would be just kind of nasty look at you would poke them, but they had a gorgeous definition. It's people being able to push the limits of their art, of themselves, of their immediate surroundings, of their atmosphere to create something that's, you know, bigger than everyone. Someone who's like completely true to themselves and like doesn't care what other people think of them. Do you see the, the beginnings of what you know is going to be a major storm? and storm clouds or the beginnings of a tornado, yeah. which can be horrendous, can be frightening, but in their natural beauty, there's still a sense of, of gorgeousness, gorgeousness to them. I think that being gorgeous is sometimes based on asymmetry a little bit, like that it's not completely perfect. Well, that's in the eyes of the beholder, right? Just like urban landscapes, um, like long drawn out highways and stuff. Without the phone, it's like one of these unexplored places that actually has a, uh, an outcome that you can't predict. Sometimes food can be really gorgeous, but really fattening oh, yeah. and really not good for you. I, you know, sometimes I think a Big Mac looks amazing, gorgeous, <laughs> but I'm not gonna eat it. When you see a dead animal on side of a road or something, it's just life and death and everything. <laughs> Whoa. Yeah, getting deep here. <laughs> Morgana here, okay. Also, I think the word gorgeous is kind of, it's quite queer. You know, when we queer. say, yeah. We say, oh, you're, you're, honey, you're so gorgeous. It means like, other people might not find you that attractive, but I, in this moment, at this time, in this club, when you're wearing this outfit, I think you are gorgeous. And you have lived up to some kind of standard that is outside of something that we all agree upon and we can look at in a magazine. Yeah, I like that. I'm just <laughs> gonna go with that. Thanks.